my name is Adriana Mariquin, and I'm here at Kalinka High School at the CTE Fine Art Showcase, being held during open house. This year's open house highlights the spectacular work of the CTE classes as they set up personalized booths and show off their hard work. I've caught up with the arts and ceramics teacher, Gretchen Urtel. Gretchen, what have you provided for this event? Um, all of the artwork here is my student stuff, and it's all over the classroom. I have art stuff up that we've created, and I also have ceramic flares that have been created also. These classes focus on specialized training for careers in fields such as child development, criminal investigation, and culinary arts. As you can see, there was way too much to check out. We had fire extinguisher for the fire extinguisher training, and I use this for my Homeland Security class. I've got some of my mannequins that I use for all of my classes for the crime scene investigation, also for them to learn basic first aid and how to handle people that have been hurt. And, um, got some handcuffs. Um, usually we do get some handcuff training and stuff. This year we weren't able to do it, um, but they learn how to uh, use the handcuffs properly to where you're not pinching uh, a suspect or something like that and hurting them. We got fingerprint readers here, so all the students learn to roll their fingerprints on regular tin cards like police departments use, and then they use the fingerprint readers to look at the prints and they're able to read the prints and uh, be able to tell identification and stuff like that in the prints. And then the rest of it is just the books that we use in class um, to learn about the subjects that we teach them. So, okay. The extravaganza portion of the event invited everyone along for live entertainment and snacks. I'm here with the principal and person responsible for throwing this fantastic event, Sheila Diaz. Mrs. Diaz, what do you hope the outcome of this event will be on your school's community? Hi everyone. So first of all, while I am extremely excited for this event, it has definitely been a group effort um, with all of the different departments involved. So my hope is after going through COVID and not being to celebrate in person for several years that we are able to have a sense of togetherness again and just really connect. So we have open house tonight that's in person as well as our CTE night and our fine art showcase that's being combined. And like I said, it's been a couple of years since we've been able to host those. So just having people out and about and interacting and being able to see the amazing things that go on at CHS. I'm Adriana Mariquin. This has been the CTE Fine Art Showcase. Thank you for tuning in.